Hello guys, Rebecca Whitman here. Happy Sunday. So today I'm going to talk to you about my journal that I was lucky enough to get when I was 19. Somebody gave me the format, never saw that person again, but I have been keeping this journal format now for I don't even know how many years, too many to count, and you know, decades. And it's literally changed my life and it's changed my, changed my thinking. So this is how the journal goes. It goes, Dear God, you did for me today what I could not do for myself. Now that's important because it's having faith that there's a power greater than myself that's looking out for me. The next thing is really good. It's the worst thing that happened today is actually the best thing. I don't know what's good for me. I think I know what I want, but I don't actually know what's good for me. So sometimes the worst things could be the best things. For example, maybe you miss a plane and that plane ends up crashing, just to be dramatic with the example. But the worst thing that we think could actually be the best thing if we have a bigger perspective. The next journal prompt is, I progress today. So it's really important to see every day how we're progressing and getting better. Just even a little bit. It could be in your exercise and your diet. Maybe you remember to drink your liquid collagen today. Maybe you were kind to someone. Maybe you complimented a stranger today. So I progress today. The next one is others progress today. It's so important to learn from people and to celebrate their wins. Maybe someone close to you did something great today. Maybe they got a promotion or maybe they just took the garbage out. But it's really good to say others progressed today and notice how other people are doing well. The next journal prompt is what I did well today. Again, celebrating the wins, what you focus on you get more of where where focus where focus goes energy flows so what did i do well today and again noticing the other people what did others do well today so that is it then i write a gratitude list five things that i surrender and i sign it love rebecca so just to recap my life changing journal prompts are number 1 the worst thing that happened is actually the best. Oh no, God, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm getting all Okay, so the first yeah, the first thing is the worst thing that happened today is actually the best thing. The next thing is God did for me what I couldn't do for myself. The next journal prompt is I progress today. The next journal prompt is others progress today. The next one is what I did well today. The next one is what others did well today. And then at least five things I'm grateful for and five things that are causing me anxiety that I want to surrender to my higher power. And then you sign it. Thank you. Love. However, you would sign a letter in your name. So if you want uh, more information on this, I'm happy to send you an email with everything that I just said. I know it's a lot. Um, otherwise, have a wonderful Sunday and I'll talk to you soon. I hope you found that helpful. Bye.